can MEPs skip the line at airports? Being elected a member of the European Parliament comes with a range of benefits, including overhead allowances, reimbursements of travel costs and money for meals. These advantages have sparked conversations online as to what exactly MEPs are entitled to and whether it's fair that they get them. Let's take a closer look. This video by Phidias Panayotou, a well-known YouTuber and independent Cypriot MEP, shows his new diplomatic passport as a newly elected member of Parliament. He says the passport allows politicians to skip the line at the airport, while also granting you free visas for countries that require them. We got in touch with the European Parliament, whose press service told us that MEPs don't get a passport with diplomatic status or diplomatic privileges or immunities. It added, though, that MEPs can get a laissez-passer, which they can use as a secure travel document for activities related to their parliamentary work only, in countries which recognise it as a valid travel document. What Panayotou appears to be holding in his video is a diplomatic passport issued by the Cypriot government. These passports, given by national governments, do confer certain advantages, like quicker diplomatic lanes at airports and waived visa requirements. The European Parliament doesn't issue diplomatic passports to MEPs, but it has a list of the benefits MEPs do get. For example, they get a general expenditure allowance to cover things like computers, office rent and supplies. It stands at €4,950, and when a member leaves office for good, they get what some would call a golden parachute. It's a transitional allowance equivalent to one month's salary per year they were in office for up to a maximum of two years. For more investigations and fact-checks, head over to Euronews.com.